hi people welcome to windows help uh, today i'm gonna show you how to fix uh, microsoft edge browser okay uh, the first step is try to close the microsoft browser edge browser completely okay at times it would still run in the background so what you can do is at the bottom right click on the task bar uh, i mean the task bar okay and select task manager once you select the task manager this is the page you get and in which it would show you all processes uh, look for microsoft edge browser if any select and end task okay this is how you could completely close the uh, edge browser uh, or else you can restart and perform the steps which i am showing you okay open file explorer file explorer is a yellow uh, folder at the bottom of the taskbar okay click on it go into c drive select this pc it would show all the drives go into c drive then users and uh, your account folder app data users my account uh, name is rocky so this is my account in which app data if you do not see this app data folder okay you may have to unhide the hidden folders how to do that i'll show you uh, click on file select change folder and search options okay and select view okay you can see don't show the hidden files or drives app data folder would not be shown select show hidden files and click on apply then ok you'll be able to see this folder this is a hidden folder select app data then local under local packages I'll give you the path at the bottom of the video okay and in this folder look for the edge uh, file microsoft dot microsoft edge underscore there would be a code followed by it okay I also share the code okay uh, select this folder open this folder uh, do control a okay and delete the files from this folder okay the folder is completely deleted now go to packages all these folders are temporary uh, files generated like a cache files generated about it so you can select all the files okay and hold the shift key and delete them okay If, if you get this kind of pop-up that it could not uh, delete or do you want to permanently delete if you get permanently delete you can uh, check this box and select yes uh, this can't be accomplished because it is open uh, select do uh, this uh, for all current items and select skip And all the files are almost deleted okay should be done meanwhile we'll check the other steps which we could do okay 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 all the files are deleted uh, after this you need to restart the computer okay please restart the machine okay now we are going to re-register microsoft edge on your account okay uh, we just need to run a command in the powershell okay for which click on start okay search for powershell
after you have the PowerShell in the search results uh, right click and run as administrator okay it would give you uh, do you want to allow this uh, file select yes okay and the PowerShell screen would open okay and uh, what you need to do is you need to copy uh, this particular command which I have provided you okay it should it should be there under the video you can check for the instructions and paste it over here a uh, directly paste it you need not paste it you just need to right click on the PowerShell screen okay and hit enter you can see deployment operation progress and it is running the command you should be getting a similar screen uh, as mine okay and the registration is completed and that's about it folks this should fix all microsoft edge browser issues okay and thank you for watching and and i am sharing the information below the video okay the written information and the command and uh, it took a lot of efforts to do this video so please do not forget to subscribe and like my video and support my channel and have a wonderful day folks